What is going on guys, Pipe here and welcome back to another video on the channel. Today EA dropped the 87 Max Hero Pack. It's quite cheap to do actually, coming in at only an 85 rated squad with a team and a weak player. And I have all of the options you can get from this Hero Pack. So we're going to go over to Twitter right now and shout out to Futspy for this graphic here. And here you can see all of the players you can get from the Hero Pack. So of course the two absolute dubs are going to be Yaya Torre. And Marquisio Guvu is another good one as well. Or Govu, sorry. Cordoba, a brilliant one to pick up. The Smalek as well. And then you have got Harry Kilkeen, Al Orian, and then Cole. And then 200 to 100, or 100k to 200k. It's going to be Brolin, Park G Sung, Nakata, and Dirk Kite. And then the 100k or less is going to be Captain Villa, Donovan, Lundberg, Solskjaer, Mostavoy, Dempsey, Crouch, Dudek, Cahill, Campos, Al Jabir, and then Lars Ricken. So. A lot of very good options from the hero pack today. And we're going to start off with our hero pack. Um, it didn't cost me anything, actually. Nothing in the club. Sorry, nothing outside of the club got put into this. Now, please give me Yaya Torre. It'd be so epic to get Yaya. It's going to be Dirk Cow, is it? Do you know what? I'm actually not too too upset with that one. He is coming in at the 100 to 200k range. And he's actually got a really good car. So I'm actually quite happy with that on my pay to win. It's coming in at like 87k, 93k, which isn't bad for a card, you know, the links to Gakpo, for example. I know he's freestyle, freestyle, but he can definitely play that box-to-box -box role. So I'm pretty happy with that one, guys. Um, looks to be a good card. Has some good traits. Um, can play bullet box-to-box -box role, as I said. Really nice with that. Good passing, good dribbling as well. Okay strength and okay defensively. Awesome, awesome shooting on Dirk Cow as well. Obviously an ex-Liverpool player, so not too happy with that, guys. But let's get into another one. For cheap FIFA 23 coins, make sure to check out MMOEXP.com to get fast and reliable coins. And make sure you use code VIPER at checkout. Get yourself a 5% discount. All right, guys. So as we get into pack number two, I just want to quickly state how good value this is. It's absolutely incredible value, man. Um, I don't know if I've been, I've already got the price of it. But it seems that Govu's coming out a lot and Park G Sung are coming out a lot of this pack. I just want to quickly go to the SBC section of Futbin just to take a look if they've already got it. It's 80,000 coins this is coming in at. Which is really, really good value, guys. I implore all of you to get this done as, you know, there's a lot of good options. And if you do pack, you know, the the Yaya Toure, the, the Park G Sung, the Marquisio, you're absolutely loving life. Obviously, there's a lot of stinkers as well. Let's see what we get in this one. Who is it going to be? It's going to be Campos. Oh, dear. And it's on Matt's account as well. Oh, he is genuinely useless. And if you do get him, it is a massive L, you know. He's got good speed and really good diving and reflexes. But he is five foot seven for a goalkeeper. That is absolutely horrendous. With three star skills and a four-star weak foot. Absolutely woeful card to pick up, guys. If you do get this one, you are done for. So hopefully not too many of you get this one. But thank you, Matt, for the pack regardless. All right, guys. So next up is going to be the Cambridge fan, Duck. Thank you very much for giving us a pack, bro. Fingers crossed we don't see too many campuses, man, because... That really does stink. You know, you don't want to be seeing too many of him. I think my one was a good pull over Dirk Cow. Dirk Cow. How do you say his name? I forget how to say his name nowadays. Dirk Coy. Is that it? I think that might be it. He's got a few contracts just sitting there. Fair play to the boy. You've got to have a few contracts in your other side pile. But here we go with the Hero Pack. 87 max overall. Yaya Torre or Marquisio. Go on. Do it for us. It's going to be Captain Villa, is it? Ooh, do you know what? He's quite cheap. But he's a bit of a... For me, anyway, I really liked him growing up. I don't think he's got the best card this year, though. Obviously, he's a new hero. His pace is okay. His crossing's okay. His passing's all right. His long shots are brilliant. Agility and balance is very low. Dribbling quite poor. Strength and aggression quite poor. Really weird card, this one, guys. Uh, probably not worth it. How much is he coming in at? He's coming in at about... Like, 80k? Maybe, maybe 100k? 70k, probably. Looking at that. Not a bad pull, but... Quite an interesting one at the same time as well. Is he good enough, guys? Let me know in the comments below. Let's get into another one. All right, guys. So over to the road to glory. Obviously, we've got rank one this week on this account in Fut Champs. So we're looking for an improvement to the team. I think Ayayo Torre, we're going on an absolute treat here. Probably wishful thinking. We've just got our preseason packs as well, which is nice. We're not going to open them today on today's video. But we've got all of the Kickstarter packs and so, so on and so forth. We are here, here for the 87 Max Hero. Come on. Yoyo Torre, Marquisio, not Jorge Campos. Please, not Campos. Please, please, please. It's going to be Hidetoshi Nakata. And he's actually quite good on this game, you know. I am very, very happy with that pull, guys, on my road to glory. He will be going into my team, and he's got a really good card as well. I'm, once again, 
Very, very impressed with these packs so far. He pays for the pack. Four star, four star, five nine. Okay defensively. Uh, as a box to box, once again, similar to what we got on our pay to win. He's got a really good card as well. Good long shots, good passing, really good dribbling, and okay defensively. I'm really, really, really over the moon with that pull, guys. He will go straight into our team on the road to glory, which is just brilliant to see, you know. Um, let's go and quickly have a look at the team and see what we can do. I don't know if he can play centre mid, so that's what I want to quickly check. Because if he can, oh man, he can play centre mid. So we'll probably pop him in over probably Bruno. Because uh, he's going to get full chem anyway, right? I don't know what it's going to do for Rashford. Rashford's still going to remain on the chemistry. And that means I can go and sell Bruno Fernandes now, which is really, really nice to see. I think he's actually stuck at 17k. But a really good pull on the road to glory, guys. Let's move on to one more account. So, guys, just coming back to Futbin again, you can see the most popular players, and that's how we're going to be able to see which ones are getting pulled the most. So, it looks like there's a lot of parts coming out. And it looks like there's a lot of Yaya Torres coming out. I've actually just seen somebody on Twitter just uh, DM me saying that they got Yaya Torre. If you want to follow me on Twitter, it's twitter.com slash wipeization. We've got a lot of Govu, a lot of uh, Nakata, a lot of uh, Dirk Cow as well. Marquisio, Captain Villa's coming out quite a lot. It's a shame. I haven't seen any Cordobas yet. There hasn't been a single Cordoba I have seen. Al Jabir, obviously, is getting packed a lot, but he's at the back end, which is strange. Uh, but yeah, guys, there's lots of good options. Let me know in the comment section below what you got in your pack. And yeah, I mean, who's probably the best one that's easy-ish to get? You know, I'd, I'd say Brolin's a really good one. He's really good in-game, really good shooting, really well-balanced card, that one as well. So I'd say Brolin's a really good one if you've got him, guys. Of course, if you've got Yaya Park, Govu or um, Marquisio, you're absolutely living the dream. Uh, but yeah, guys, those are what's popular on Fuckbin right now and what's coming out of packs at the moment. All right then, guys. So last account for today, we've got Owen Slater. What a legend this guy is. Let's take a look at his team real quick. He's got the Makalele, obviously, that we did get him out of the base icon pack. He's got Messi. He's got Arnautovic. He's got the posh guy as well. And then he's got Correa Red, Valverde, Lamar, Tellez, a really, really stacked account for Owen here with Haaland on the reserves, where he does belong now, in my opinion. He's also got 3 million coins. So this guy is stacked out to the max. What does he want, really? If we go back and have another look at his team, what is he kind of after? So he wants to replace Makalele, really. A Yaya Torre or Marquisio to go in there would be absolutely brilliant. Even a Nakata, like we just got on our road to glory, would be quite nice for Owen, I think. And here we go, guys. The last one of today's video let us see what we get. Come on, Owen. You deserve something good, man. You really do deserve something good. It's going to be a walkout, which is a good start. It's going to be... Oh, it's Al Jabba. Al Jabir, or however you say his name. That's really bad. That's really... really he's got a good card, actually, though. Like, good pace, good shooting. If it was the other guy, it would have been better. The right winger. He's three-star, three-star, 5'10". Good finishing and shooting, generally. But dribbling's not very good. Strength isn't very good. He's not that good in the air, either. So a pretty disappointing one to end off on, guys. But if you did enjoy today's video, lads, make sure you leave a like on it, subscribe to the channel, and turn on the bell so you don't miss a video. But guys, it's going to be it for me for now, so take care.